Okay, guys, we're back at Little Beaver, and uh, we got our carp rods and stuff with us today. So, we got four carp rods back here set up in the stands. I'll get to it in a little bit, but we're going to try to. I still ain't caught a largemouth yet, so I'm going to try to get a bass caught right quick, maybe a couple. All of our trout today, we're going to turn them loose if we catch any, unless they're hurt. So, we got about 20 in the freezer, but. Uh, All right, guys, what we're using today, we're using straight up chicken feed. That right there is what you feed your laying hens. They sell it at Walmart, Tractor Supply, any kind of feed store. If you don't have soybean meal, this is a good alternative. And I've already got everything baited up and this is this really does make some good, good, good pack bait. But uh, see if we can't catch some carp on some chicken feed. Catfish will eat it. I've caught trout on it, all kinds of stuff. But uh, let's see if we can't get something done here. All right, guys, let's see if we can't catch us a, a large mouth. I'm going to start out this copper truce Ned rig. This damn water's a little bit off-colored. And uh, like I said, I just, I ain't caught a large mouth yet. I'd like to get that done real quick. Throw so right over top of it. I got it loose. Well, I thought, well, first cast, there went my fucking copper truce Ned rig. Let's try it again. <clears throat> Work that back to you. I'll throw this out for you. Here. Got you slack wound up in that thing. Remember how you caught that fish the other day? Hey. Get him, honey. Got him? Yeah. Good deal. Hold him, honey. Hold that rod up. Don't point it at the fish. You keep that rod up. Good deal, honey. Hold that rod up. Keep that rod up. Job, buddy. Beautiful rainbow. Remember what I told you. Beautiful rainbow. Beautiful rainbow. Barely had him hooked. We're going to have to kind of duck and move the rain. Didn't get the release on that fish. I read through the camera and it wasn't working, so it wasn't on. But we released it unharmed. Uh, like I said, it's... We're really up here trying to catch some in big carp. We'll see what happens. Every trout we catch will be released if it ain't hurt. Okay, so if I can't throw this square bill around here and get bit... I'd love to catch me a bass. Had to kind of stay close to this carport up here because of the weather. They're here. A good little rig, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Little pink worm. See if ever see if this stuff's buried up in the grass or not. It don't feel like it. Yeah. Yeah. A little bit. That's the shitty part about this lake, man. Mm. 
getting a bite right there. PB here though. Oh, is it? Yeah. There we go. You see the whole fish? Yeah. Seven pound, three ounces, guys. Chicken feed, guys. Hold on, chicken feed. Decent little fish. There's a nice catfish for this place. Really a nice channel cat for anywhere. Fat fish. No luck on the crankbait, guys. Throw this spinner bait up here in this flat. That same rod too. Look there. Watch that rod. Watch. Now just wind, lean into him. Raise your rod up. Let me turn the clicker off. No, he ain't. No, he ain't. Now, wind him in. Hold that rod up. Hold that rod up. Same rod. That might be a cart.
Just come right here between these. Right here, there you go. Keep that rod up. There you go. Wind it, honey, wind it. That's a catfish, I bet. It's another channel cat, I about guarantee it. I don't know, we don't need the net. You can pull him right back up on the bank. Another catfish, that's a good one too. Another big old channel cat. Come on, come on. Come on, that's bigger than mine. Big old channel. Come on. Come on. Wind your slack down. Walk towards him, cranking your slack up. Walk towards him. Wind down into him. Now just walk backwards. Get him up on the bank. Easy. Easy, I'll get him. That's a nice one. That's bigger than that other one. Golly, look here what a channel cat. Look here, boys. Beautiful, beautiful channel catfish, baby doll. Good job, honey. Good job, baby. <laughs> Here. Hup, popped right out. Did it? Yeah. I don't know how I kept him on there Golly. as long as it is. Twelve one. Fatty man. I got a uh, Berkeley garlic egg on here for a pickup. Switch in here. That's chicken feed, guys. Straight up chicken feed. That's what you feed your laying hens. Wrap that around there. No method rig, no method lead, none of that. A number two owner circle hook on a Carolina rig, slip rig, and that's it. That's it, guys. Made it to catch carp with, but uh, huh. catfish work. Big channels like that. Don't hear me complain about that at all. Okay, guys, I've give up on the bass. Throw his Joe fly around a little bit.
There we go, there's a trap. There we go, on the old Joe fly. There we go. We're going to put him back, though, guys. There he goes. He gone. All right, guys, that's a wrap. We got about 20 or 30 minutes and the rain set in here on us again. So we're up here underneath the carport and uh, we'll give it about 30 minutes. We're gonna get out of here. Didn't catch no carp. 12 pound channel cat at work. that catfish babe hey, what do you think it was big. you liked that didn't you they have got to teach you how to hold them you got anything you want to say to the world uh, she's shy guys rain come to catch carp caught two giant channel cats you know what that'll, that'll work guys everything will eat that pack babe it don't matter caught carp bluegill catfish trout all kind of stuff bass all kind of stuff on that pack mate. but uh, she ain't nowhere near dressed for success tried to tell her but uh, guys we'll see you next time on AT Outdoors Relationship Goals taking those ladies fishing boys